to keep the four drop and the two drop and we're going to hope to find a three drop at some point i'm really down for any three drop location prince venomous scorpion any of them we have a five drop which is also very good um but yeah i mean i'm down to just play the oh are you naga or you might be thief you might be thief now that i think about it now that i'm thinking about it out loud might be a thief rogue because he didn't play any oh Oh, hot dog. Hot dog. I'm uh, at a loss here right now. I'm not sure exactly what that he's going. Probably Naga. Light Bomb's going to be very good at dealing with that. We have three, four, five, six. We actually curve out really well here. And this will kill all the small Nagas. I mean, Naga Priest is a really, really good deck. I just need to try to find maybe Shard of Naru to silence a big minion. That would probably be the way to try to do this. We will play this turn four, this turn five to draw some extra cards. Unless there are minions I need to kill with clean the scene. Could be Thief Row or Thief Priest to O. Naga? Serpent Wing, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. The light. It burns! Yeah, we're gonna keep that, obviously. And we're gonna hope that he plays, like, Bless on this so he can kill it. <laughs> Drown, Whirlpool, Venomous Corporate. Actually, all really good choices. Whirlpool's a bit slow, but I actually think I can make it to turn 7 pretty easily, because I'm gonna coin it out turn 7, worst case scenario. So I'm pretty sure I can make it that far. So we'll keep it. All the epics and legendaries I get are, mo are from the worst class in the game, Demon Hunter and Warrior. Yeah. To be fair, though, Demon Hunter is actually on the rise. It's on the up and up a little bit. It's not as bad. Some streamers were saying that it might actually become, like, middle of the pack. Which is not bad. Literally, first two legendaries were for Demon Hunter, and the last two I just got were for Warrior. Yeah. Legendary-wise, yeah, none of them are really that. Like, the Warrior... Olgra's okay. If, if we get Warrior to work, Olgra will be decent. Um, Trying to think what else... What's the second Demon Hunter Legendary? It got the one that discards your hand. Did it even get two? It had to have gotten two. I do not remember at all. That's probably very bad. Or that just shows how bad the... Card is. <clears throat> oh! Luckily, we have the light it burns to. Wait, you're not gonna pump it? That's a little bit weird, champ. Don't I just kill it with clean the scene? Doesn't I just. Boop! And he lives. Like, this guy also lives. That was so incredibly good for me. Wait, okay, we're looking. Don't tell me. I'm not looking at chat. I'm gonna figure this out myself. What's the other legendary? Oh, the relic dude! Of course! I forgot about. Okay, that actually was a pretty decent legendary. Fair enough. That is probably the better of the two legendaries, honestly. That's crazy, I forgot about that one. My bad, my B. I don't really wanna play Light Bomb, but I will in order to progress the quest. We still have the Light It Burns and Whirlpool. We're just trying to complete this as quickly as possible. We can play you next turn if we don't get anything good. Um, We'll take Venomous Scorpid to discover a spell. We didn't find either of the seven drops, so that's fine. Even if he's able to build up a white board, I have Whirlpool. Um, I can discover a spell. I've got another Light Bomb. I've got Shadow Word Ruin if that happens. I've got two Light It Burns. I've got S Silence in the deck, although I haven't drawn any yet. We still have it. Like, this is a pretty good matchup, I think. Basically, if you're playing against a board-based deck, this deck is going to do well. If you're playing against a combo deck, this deck might do okay if you can finish your quest quickly enough. And if you're playing against Shaman, you just... Insta concede. Blessing, Whoa, my guy. Bro, hold the phone. What are you going to target it with? An O? Oh? oh, fair enough. Okay. That's interesting. The Light It Burns actually still probably works best here, though. We get to play this in the Light It Burns. <laughs> I'm gonna save this for Zyrella potentially, so we're gonna go. I don't think order really matters here. We're just gonna go boom and the light it burns to kill off the 9 9. We still got Whirlpool. We can draw cards off of this. We still got. Yeah, we're in a pretty decent spot, I think. We killed off 
Probably one of the best minions in that deck, though. He should probably concede at this point, in the least toxic way possible. I guess he has, like, one or two more ways we can develop a board. He's got the, um, the minion that copies itself and one more boon of the Ascended, as well as the Serpent Wig, and I don't actually have a Silence in my hand yet, so... There are a couple of ways he could still win. Oh. Oh, no. He might be committing now. Which means I'm gonna have to play a Whirlpool. Hopefully he kills my 5-5 so I don't even have to Whirlpool my Spirit Guide. That'd be pretty sick, actually. Quest Priest. Hell yeah, time for 20-minute games. Okay, first of all, wrong. The last game I played was only 15 minutes. Looks like you, you look like an idiot now. Ha. Pick me, pick me. Also, Gift of Nauru, that's fine. He draws a card. I'm fine with that. Second of all, this game probably won't even reach 10. Oh, I don't get to draw. Wait, that's bad. That's really bad. And then that's probably going to be Bless. Damn, that's a lot of damage. I can't believe I don't get to draw cards either. We get Silence, though. The two are one. But I think it's better to just Whirlpool this and go next. It kills off this. It gets rid of his other school teacher. So he's not able to combo as well with the Radiant Elemental or School Teacher, which is fine. We still got Silence, we still got Discover. I mean, I'm not a huge fan of this, but it's not like it's the end of the world either, yet. Oh, technically the Boon of the Ascended is not, like, it's a minion. It doesn't have buff stats, so silencing that, if he gets a really, really big one, might not even be that big of a deal for him. How much dust is it to craft? Happy Heart Queen! Thanks for the raid! How have you been? GG Boom, how's it going? It's been a while since you've raided, or I've raided you, or we've chatted. How are you doing? Yowza, okay. Well, we got silence, so... Hello. Sending love? Well, thank you. How's your stream? We are going to, I guess, silence immediately. I mean, I guess we can try to discover a spell first. Condemn doesn't quite kill everything, but it will be good later on for two mana, so we'll take that. Amazing. Buy my loves and E-Core 100, goodbye. Have a good one. Have a great stream, I'll try my best. I'll try my best, but this game can be very tilting sometimes, you know, you know. Let's uh, draw a card and then Gift of Nauru at least once or twice. Um, we could. Oh, man. I don't want to use the other one and mess up a Zyrella, so I'm just going to pass there. I might die to like a ton of Serpent Wigs and then a Bless. I still actually might die here. But he doesn't get to pump up as much, and I couldn't have killed off his minions, unfortunately. Condemn was not strong enough, but Condemn will be strong enough next turn to kill off almost everything. Then we have Shadow Word uh, Ruin. What are the odds he can do 26 damage in one turn without a Radiant Elemental? If he still had Radiant Elemental, I'd be a little bit worried, but the Queen of Hearts and the King of Tilt? It's kind of true. <laughs> Follow heart, art follow heart queen on Twitch. Need to sub to her on YouTube. Yeah, she does uh, heart to hearts. If you haven't seen her heart to hearts, heart to heart is really cool. She basically interviews uh, a lot of different creators, um, and just has a heart to heart with them. The format is pretty cool. I keep telling her that I, they could be huge. They could be huge. I just uh, like, I don't know. I think it'd be cool to maybe edit a little bit for her and do some thumbnails so her content can really pop off because I think that it's really, really cool. Like, the amount of stuff she could do with her content and the stuff they sometimes talk about, like, you could make shorts, you can make smaller little segments and break up episodes. You can edit the episodes to make them a little bit shorter so they're less intimidating to new people. There's so much that she could do, man. Ugh. So, the question is what I want to do. Uh, this doesn't really kill anything off. I think we can go Shadowed Ruin and Condemn. 
But we're starting to run low on resources here. Really need to find a 7 drop. Boom, and then condemn. I hated that. I guess technically I should have drawn first. That's my bad. We end up getting drowned. That's not that big of a deal. Counter spell. And then I'll just do this. It doesn't matter. We're going to use Surf Finley anyway. My hand is so bad. I need to find something playable. We found Mutanus, which is pretty good, but I think it's going to be too little too late. Thrive in the Shadows is very good. Zyrella is pretty decent. Oh, man. How should I have played that differently? There's going to be a turn where I end up drawing the coin now. I should have maybe used the coin. I don't know. I didn't know my next card was going to be Mutanus, though. He's going to play a Colossal Minion. Oh, and I'm going to get smacked in the face. It's going to be so much damage. I actually don't think... I actually don't think Mutanus is my win condition. I actually don't think... It's my win condition. I think my win condition is surviving until they run out of cards because they only have two cards left, right? I think that's my win condition. That's a 9-13... Much, dude, that's so big. Hang on, Zyrella. Honestly, we could look for Drown off of this. We'll draw a card first, see if we find anything. We'll put it on you so you can kill that and not die. We found Spirit Guide. We'll see if we find Drown. We don't find Drown. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's really bad. I might end up dying here. He definitely has another Shard of Nauru. I'd be absolutely... My mind would be boggled if he didn't. I think we actually lost the game. I actually think we lose here. Which is crazy. I could also trade and play Zyrella. And draw a holy... Spell. And a shadow spell. Gain 5 armor. Kill this off. And then... Because if he has silence, I'm doomed. He just goes face and does so much damage because he has another bless. Light. I'm gonna do that instead. I'm gonna do that instead. Please don't have silence. I mean, he has silence. He has silence. But maybe he only runs one because I'm looking at my build of the deck and I only run one silence. I only want to run one shard in the Rue and my Naga Priest. So, like, I'm assuming he doesn't have another one and the taunt should be enough to keep me alive and draw me cards so I can kill his 11 14. Ugh! I'm basically just hoping he net decked. My blade, blade Master Samara was definitely a card. But hopefully we can draw a bunch of cards. Sorry, squishy, I'm like if we can just if we can draw a bunch of cards, that's huge. I don't think I'd die. Even if he has bless, I'm not dead this turn. Even if he has Bless, I'm not dead this turn. And we can draw a bunch of spells. <laughs> I mean, he has to lose the wigs, right? Unless he wants to bless that. Oh my word! That is a big mother... Wow! No! Any warriors seen today? I haven't seen any warriors today, no. The light it burns, thrive in the shadows, cut the scene, drown, and desperate prayer. So that does. So desperate prayer will do quite a good chunk of damage, actually. Desperate prayer does a lot of damage. No, wait, we wiped the board, right? So it goes four. No, because he only heals seven. Oh my god, wait, that actually is really bad for me. Oh my word. Okay, we have to do this and hope for a whirlpool. We found it. Okay. I think this means we win because we kill off all of his things. Can he do 11 damage of burst? Can he do 11 damage of burst to me? I'm going to play Desperate Prayer just in case he can. I don't know exactly what he could have run, but I'm doing that just in case. Okay, it's fine. We can drown that. I'm okay with that. I'm pretty sure he's dead, though. 
You know how I said this game was going to take maybe 10 minutes at most? I lied. That was troll. He could have had a bigger minion. He should have had a bigger minion, actually. He could have pumped that up three. He could have pumped that up twice. He could have he could have made this a 512. He could have easily made this a 512. Why didn't he do that? What the hell? Silence, drown the 3-8. Heal myself. Yeah, we're okay, cool. Well, I thought that game was gonna be so much faster than it was. Um, we are going to get rid of both. I mean, Shadow Ruin might be okay because it's a four drop, but I don't think so. We're gonna get rid of everything and look for a two, three, and a better four, ideally. Hopefully we don't draw terribly. Wow, okay, this is not looking too good. I really don't like Kael'thas and Bran. Kael'thas, Bran, and Athreus is just too strong. The more I play about against it, the more I hate it. And like, the fact, I don't know. I don't really have words. <laughs> as long as Shaman exists and is decent, and it is decent. Oh my god, it's Quest. Holy crap, wait, this changes literally everything. This literally changes everything. But anyway, as long as Control Shaman exists, it's just, it's so BS. It really is. It, you Control X can't exist. You get to... You have an OTK that can do 50 plus damage. You've got Evolve. You got decently sized, pretty big minions. You've got insane amounts of disruption and board freeze and pretty good removal. You have one of the better heroes, although not the best, but one of the better heroes. Like, it's just there's so much wrong with Shaman. I really wanted that class to be gutted. I said it once before. I feel like it... Shaman, where it is now, feels like what Ticketus felt like a year ago. For those of you who played with Ticketus, you remember having your, like, watching five to ten of your cards get burned? The only difference is, Shaman is good. Like, Shaman is very good. I think it's still gonna be a top five class. I don't know. It bugs me. This is not active, but it doesn't matter. We're just gonna play it. We'll probably end up also playing Spirit Guide and then playing Sir Finley to find new cards because my hand is ass right now. Fair enough. Free title search. I'm fine with that. Magic. He draws one card. Two? Oh, yeah. That's a... um. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. I'm sad that I'm losing a five drop and then I'm going to trade away this one as well, but like we have to. Maybe it wouldn't have changed anything, but you could trade a card and then play a card and then trade it to make him believe... You have the shard in hand to make him use the Mad Duke. What are you talking about? Oh, you're saying trade a card and then if I have it play... Okay, that makes some sense for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that actually isn't terrible. We kill everything and just go face. I mean, maybe I don't end up playing Serpent Lane. We have a 7 and 8. We just need to draw a 4 and we're fine. I don't know. Yeah, Bran and Sire Denathrius, and then you can also just drop Sire Denathrius and then play Brilliant Macaw the next turn if you didn't happen to have Bran. Like, there's so many broken things about Shaman that just make it so hard to, like, justify it. Like, the more I play it, the harder it is to defend. Do I think I'm more likely to discover a 4-cost spell or draw a 4-cost spell? I think I'm more likely to discover one, actually. And then we'll pump that up. We don't really have that many five drops Golden left. Wait. I needed a two drop. Oh my God, I thought I needed a four. Oh. That's fine. Was I offered a two drop there? Oh no. Oh, I'm a troll, I trolled. It's okay, it's fine. Everything's fine, we're fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's not fine. I goofed, I goofered. Why did I do that? Oh my gosh, okay, I need to pay more attention. I'm, I'm ranting about Shaman right now because I hate the glass, but honestly, it's fine. Wow, he can wipe the board there, that's crazy. We get a five drop, that's fine. We get another four, it's fine. We'll kill it. And then we'll draw an extra card. We get a two drop! Yes! Okay, we're in the we're in the game again. We're back, baby. 
We're back. Yeah, I don't, I mean, Snowball Guardian definitely was a good nerf, and it makes it much harder for them to deal with board-based deck, so, like, aggro can actually shut Shaman down now, so it actually has a weakness, but it just completely invalidates control. Whoa, what? Oh, no, that was a discovered card. I thought that was a card he ran in his deck because it didn't say it for us. Oh, my word, what in the fuck? Holy God, wow, what on earth is happening? Oh my god, wow. Um, we can kill it with uh, the clean the scene, though. Wow. Um, Alright, hit. Does nothing. We play this, and then we're going to play clean the scene. We kill off our own dude, that's okay. We are going to play... Do we want to play Ice Trap, or do we want to play Sticky Situation? I think Sticky Situation is a little bit more annoying for them to deal with, so I think we take that. No, Ice Trap's definitely more annoying. We look for a six drop, baby. No six drop, baby, but we get a draw, which is fine. Maybe we can find a six drop. Uh, clean the scene. Ice trap? No, go ice trap, I guess. I mean, you can play wind chill or something, but it's not that bad. Even though he's quest shot and be careful, Corey, you can still run Mutanus in theater. Dude, I know. Makes me sad. Makes me pretty upset, actually. Pretty upsetty spaghetti. And some taunts. Draw me a six. Six drop. Six drop. That's a five. It's not the worst thing in the world. Six drop. Gosh darn it. Condemn. To kill him off. Play this. Light cannot exist. If I hero power, I don't actually lose anything. Heal up. Pass. If this dies, I draw two cards. I go to nine, then I'll go to ten when I draw the next card. Grr! Give me a six! Doom hammer? Whoa! No, wait a minute. That actually might be sick. No, Doom Hammer might be really cool. Genuinely. Because, like, double activate Rockbiter weapon. But how much damage can you really do with that? Is the question, I guess. The storm is in me. Six drop. Six drop. Six. Frostbite? <gasps> he makes this a six drop. You fool! <laughs> Fool. You've given me what I needed. <laughs> um, I could either go Shadowward Ruin or Drown. I, th I actually think I should probably play Drown. I genuinely do. Um, if I, I think Shadowward Ruin might actually be useful against something in the future, so we'll just go Drown. Let's go! Puggers! Thrive in the Shadow Fields a little bit slow. We can take this and maybe play a secret. We can take this and just end up playing a secret, I guess. None of the other options are really that good. It generates more resources. I'm down. Where you followed? Where you followed? Um, we're gonna go with Sticky Situation and play that. And pass for now. This guy's crazy! This guy is kind of crazy, though. Clownfish himself uh, justify running the whole Murloc package even in a control environment, and that's crazy. Wait, what? Oh, Perpetual Flame does kill that. It's a little bit lame. Wait, okay. But yeah, you can run the you can run the Murloc package in Shaman. It's pretty good. Seven drop! Seven drop! Seven drop! Seven drop! Pretty good. Pretty good, if I do say so myself. There's a six drop. Would have liked that a little bit earlier, but okay. Bada bing. Bada boom. Draw a card. We do not end up overdrawing, though, because we're not going to use the other one. And then this hits there. We can play Condemn and Whirlpool together next turn if needed. Not sure what I want to do yet. 
Did you know you'd be one of the top three arena streamers on Twitch if you moved platforms? Arena? What arena are we talking Like, Hearthstone Arena? Magic Arena? Also, why would I change games completely? Also, people watch me for standard. They don't watch me for arena. I do think arena is really fun, and if people would watch it... I've come out with a couple of arena videos, and they all did mid. If not, just straight bad. It's a 3-3 taunt. That's fine. That's what condemns for. Hello! How's it going? This guy has a crazy shaman list, though. True! This guy's shaman list is nuts. Ow. Is it just me, or do they just not have enough overload cards? We got theater. I could go theater this turn to see if he's running, like, has it in his hand. But we know this is a random spell, but he's had this card since the beginning. And I feel like playing theater and not playing an 8-drop this turn to know it's in his hand is fine. But then he also has, like, two turns to draw into something good. I'm gonna go Whirlpool. And then it gives me the lady, and then I play... Nothing. I'll overdraw, so I guess I end up playing Desperate Prayer, I guess. We get her, that's pretty cool. We go Desperate Prayer. We'll pass. I mean, we have almost an entirely full hand. I don't know. I I, I could have seen what was in his hand, because he's held on to that since turn four, but I couldn't do it. Whoa! That's almost sick, but it's not, but it almost is. That's almost really cool. This gives me a... Mm, boom. I kind of want to play theater. Just to see if I can... But we know what his spells are, right? This is from last turn or... Yeah, okay, last turn. He played Lightning Storm, I think a Perpetual, he played Overdraft and Frostbite. I still don't think I'm dead. I'm pretty sure we just gotta do this. Let's draw a card first. We do not get it. We will play this. I mean, we could just trade these two as well. And if we don't find it, then we can play it. Okay, we don't find it. We don't find it. Okay, then we will do this. We get the shard. I'm at eight cards in hand. I'm going to pump this up and draw an extra card. So if he does top deck theater, he is less likely to hit it. Oh, I guess I could have played the zapper. No, because then it would have been overloaded. That would have been bad. So we win the game next turn with the purified shard unless he has theater. But this is why we wanted to have as many cards in here as possible. Deck code? Wait, did I not send the deck code earlier? My bad. Copy pasta. Badoom. Badoom bop. Oh! Oh! No! Oh! I can't win this turn! Hey, okay, that was well played. You know what? That was that was pretty well played. I respect it. I respect it. The path is clear. Thrive in the shadows. Uh, we'll get, I don't know, freaking whirlpool or something. Light Bomb, it's cheaper removal. It ends up doing Frostbite again. I mean, I guess Light Bomb is probably the best option. I couldn't win the game. He's a god, dude. Oh, he's so good. He's too good at the game. He's too good at the video game. What do you intend on playing for after Priest? As of right now, unsure. I think this guy's playing Shaman is honestly just completing quests for EXP on the Tavern Pass. Well, now I really want to play a quest Shaman, okay? Don't, don't flame. No flame allowed. This guy's kind of going off. Yes, we do get to win with the Purified Shard. Yes! Got him.